There was one man for the Quinnipiac men's basketball team that was heading to this scorer's table pretty frequently today, and that was Kevin Marfo. It's because J.J. Riggins, the other big man in the middle for the Bobcats, was out with an injury today, but that didn't stop Marfo from having a big day. 16 points and 17 rebounds, a double-double, and those 16 points were only off of six shots from the field. Now, while fans may want Kevin to be a little bit more aggressive, he thinks of the opposite. If I got 16 points off of six shots, I, I probably should just kind of keep focusing on what I'm doing, right? You know what I'm saying? Like, the game flows, you know? Like I said, we have other guys who, who take shots, you know? If I could do that every game off of six shots, that should be the goal. And we're winning like that, and the team's playing well, and there's a balanced team. It can't be like, oh, you need to take more shots. Maybe if I continue to do that at that pace, that could be something dangerous. I'm really proud of the way he's grown and gotten better, not only as a player, but just as a competitor, as a man. We do not win that game if in the second half especially he doesn't come up with key offensive rebounds, tip-ins. Things that, you know, they show up in the box score, but they're not fancy or glitzy when you watch them. So he's a guy that's just out there competing. He knows it's his last year of college. He's playing with desperation. And, um, you know, our team is really feeding off him. I'm really proud of him. And tonight's 73-67 to win means a season sweep for the Quinnipiac Bobcats over the Ryder Bronx. But the Bobcats will have a new opponent coming into the People's United Center, and that opponent will be the Owen Gales this Sunday afternoon at 2 p.m. Reporting from the People's United Center, Eric Kerr, Q30 Sports.